These students believe that the power of the Hispanic vote in Arizona will be decisive in the midterm elections and that their votes can have an impact. If more Latinos are encouraged to vote, of course we can. Many of my family members don't vote. They don't want to vote. And I believe there can be change if Latinos vote. The National Association of Latino Elected Officials estimates that more than 664,000 Hispanic voters in Arizona will vote in the midterms, marking a turning point in Latino election participation. According to the United States Census Bureau, Latinos in Arizona are young, with an average age of 27. That translates to growing political power. It's going to be very important for candidates and political parties to pay attention to what the top issues are for Latinos, especially young people. Carolina Rodriguez Greer is a state director of the nonprofit Mi Familia Vota, or My Family Votes. Her Latino Focus campaign has registered more than 35,000 new voters this year. What are the issues that are encouraging you to vote in this election? Since my family is from Mexico, problems that the undocumented people face and helping undocumented people. For me, it's the economy. The economy because everything is very expensive. The right that every person has to live. There are problems with abortion. Inflation, gun violence and jobs are the top priorities among Hispanic voters in Arizona, according to a recent Unidos U.S. poll. They are interested in the issues. They want to know how they're going to get help to improve their lives. They want to know where and when to vote to make sure their voice is heard in this election. Latinos are the second largest voting group in Arizona. And overall, the fastest growing sector of the U.S. electorate. Jorge Agobian, VOA News, Tucson, Arizona.